guys, so now we're gonna show you some tips on how to fight COVID-19. Yeah, exactly. So first, we're gonna show you how to wash your hands. Yeah, this is the tip number one. This is the most important one given by all the government. You need to wash your hands properly for at least 20 to 25 seconds. Yeah? Yes, at least. So exactly. if you want to do it more, you can do it more. It's better. Yeah, of course, but yeah, at least 20 seconds. Yeah. So let's see how to do it pro properly. Mm -hmm. So the first thing is use warm water, right? Do not use cold water. Warm water is what you want. Yes, it's better. Get enough soap, water. right? And then rub your hands thoroughly. You can do this motion first. Make sure you really go between the fingers like this. On the top as well, go really deep. Make sure you also do this movement there like that, when you really go inside. Don't forget the wrists, right? And then you can rinse, yeah? And when you're finished, do not use a towel. Make sure you use some disposable towel like this one, right? And after you're done, you directly to bean, bean it. it. Exactly. Yeah, over there, directly like that. And there you go. This is how you wash your hands cleanly and safely to eliminate any trace of the virus, right? Yes. Guys, our second tips is this one. So show them what's our second tips. Yeah, so this one is all about coughing, yeah? Mm -hmm. So this one, make sure you do not cough like this into your hands. Yeah. You have to do it in your elbow like this. Yeah? So <coughs> do it like that. The reason is you want to avoid contaminating your hands as much as possible, right? Because your hands, you use them to do a lot of things. You're going to touch all the surfaces, the objects. You do not want them to be contaminated, right? Mm -hmm. So again, the message is for this one. Use your elbow whenever yeah. you need to, to cough. Yeah? Because also another yeah. thing, if you shake, shake hands and other people, at least yeah. your hands are clean. Yeah, so exactly. that's the big point also exactly. for that. Although about checking hands, we're going to have a tip of the, about this later, right? Yeah. So stay tuned. Mm -mm. Okay, guys, tips number three. How to greet people without shaking hands. Yeah, okay, so this one is very important because one way you can really uh, propagate the virus is by shaking hands, yeah? If, if you have the virus, probably you have it on your hand. If you shake people's hands, it's gonna spread out, right? So another recommendation is Instead of shaking hands, mm -hmm. you can do two things. Either you can do you can do a fist bump like this. Yeah, Hi. like that. But you're still touching hands, so it's it's okay. But yeah, not really good. Another one which is even better, you do the this, elbow pump yeah, like that. Yeah. Like that. Hi, <laughs> how are you doing? <laughs> exactly. And it's even yeah, it's, it's even really good. fun, right? So yeah. it's good. And this one is really safe because you know you're not gonna propagate any virus like that, virus like that, right? So it's a really good one. Number four. Sneezing. If you feel a sneeze coming up or you need to blow your nose, just make sure you use a disposable tissue like that, right? Blow your nose, then when you're done, immediately just bin it. Yeah? Do not keep it around. It's very disgusting. You need to really bin it as soon as possible. Uh, do not use things like a handkerchief or a face towel. Uh, the problem with this is that the virus can stay inside and you will spread the virus as well. So. Again, use disposable tissues, bin them as soon as you've used them, and this way it's much more hygienic and better. Alright, tip number five, hand sanitizers and alcohol. If you're out and about, make sure you always have with you hand sanitizers of alcohol with at least 60% alcohol, right? That's very important. The reason is that if you're touching things, you're, you're in the tube, or uh, I don't know, you, you don't know uh, what the surfaces you're touching, Make sure you always have something to clean them, to clean them, sorry, multiple times a day to make sure you're out of the virus, right? Very important. Yes, that's tip number five. Number six, guy, we should be vigilant to our elderly family because they are the one who is more affected with this kind of virus. So we should let them. Yeah, we should let them be at home as much as possible. You know, uh, unless they really have to, it's better that they stay inside, it's safer for them, right? Yeah, and also we should be vigilant for ourselves yeah. as well. Yeah, exactly. I mean, even if we are less susceptible, of course, we don't want to catch the virus, maybe pass, pass it on to them. So yeah, be vigilant as well for yourself. Yes. 
Yeah, so guys, that's all I think for our tips and advice. Hopefully, guys, um, we can help a bit at least. Bonus tip today, avoid your habit of touching your face and nose with your hands. Yeah? Your hands and fingers, fingers, this is where the virus live. So avoid touching your face and nose as much as possible. Right? This is how the virus spread. So that's the tip for today. So that's all guys for our tips and advice. I hope it's gonna help a bit. And for this time now, we should be strong and look after for each other. Yeah, let's look after each other, make sure the virus doesn't spread. Yeah. Don't panic, it's, it's gonna be fine. Yes. We will be able to, to beat this, right? Yeah, and hope for the best. Exactly, prepare for the worst, but just smile and carry on, yeah? Yeah, yeah. get on. Exactly. Yeah, life <laughs> must go on. Yeah. So thank you for watching, guys. I hope you're thank not you. gonna forget to subscribe and comment down below. Yeah. Bye! Bye, -bye.